He's 80 years old, and he's running for re-election. Joe Biden right, making his sure pitch to voters to let him finish the job with a second term in office. While the announcement didn't come as a surprise, some supporters expressed concerns about his age. Yeah, if he's in fine health and he feels like he's able to do the job, then I think it's perfectly fine. Um, I, 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 I would prefer, honestly, if uh, an opportunity was given to someone who was a, a bit younger and may have like fresh ideas for the country. Um, I like what Biden's done. I think he's done a really good job. Uh, I personally wish he wouldn't run again. I think he, I'm 72. He's older than I am. He's really too old for the job. Still, polls show most Democrats would support Biden in a general election. Former President Donald Trump, who's running again for the Republican nominee, was quick to disparage the president on social media. You could take the five worst presidents in American history and put them together, and they would not have done the damage Joe Biden has done to our nation in just a few short years, not even close. Trump is riding high in the polls among Republican voters, and it's looking more likely that the 2024 presidential election will be a rematch between Biden and Trump. Even though the support for Biden is much more tepid on the Democratic side, ultimately it's a trade-off. He's shown he can beat Trump, and when it comes to being a choice between Trump's America and Biden's America, and that's very much how Biden framed it in this announcement, uh, Biden wins. Biden has not directly addressed concerns about his age, instead telling the critics to watch me as he continues doing his job.